not far away. I went to visit for a day. Got covered with some gooey ooze that changed my DNA. Now I try to act normal, keep my cool. Why other kids play after school? I turn into a prehistoric hero. I'm in. Today on Dino Squad, <laughs> Halloween has more tricks than treats when Velocity's henchmen unleash a giant Spider-saurus. Go Dino! Hey Buzzard, it's Halloween! How come you're not wearing a mask? <laughs> Very funny, Samantha. What's that wacky dance step you're doing? It's just something I made up. I call it the Funky Pterodactyl. Yeah, well, it's for the birds, just like you, Buzzard. <laughs> Sam, knock it off. Buzz is cool. Uh -huh. Huh? It's your weird neighbor from next door. Could you please turn down that music? I can't concentrate on my work. Watch this. You don't know how to have fun doesn't mean we can't. Go back to your haunted house. Sorry. <laughs> that wasn't very nice, Sam. Come on, you have to admit she looks awful creepy. All by herself in that horrible house of hers? Everyone knows she's weird. Tell me about it. Ever since I was a kid, all she does is scowl at me or chase me off her prize crabgrass. Maybe she's not our friendliest neighbor, but that's no reason to judge her because of the way she looks. I've talked to her a few times, and she seems like a normal lady to me. If she's normal to you, that proves she's weird. Huh? This is another one of those towns where those perfect dinosaurs have been spotted. Dr. Velocity wants to try luring them back. Ready to make some dino bait? Absolutely. If Velocity's plan works, when that spider mutates, it should attract one of those perfect dinosaurs. And we'll be ready for it. Way down, Mrs. Krell. As if disturbing me with that awful music wasn't bad enough. Now your inconsiderate guests are trespassing on my property. But I've been here the whole time. No one's left the party. I saw them with my own eyes. Two punks dressed like space aliens trampled my flowers. Those dead roses? This is your last warning. The next time, I'll call the police. Mrs. Krell, she is such a fruitcake, accusing us of ruining her ugly flowers. Yeah, the only thing ruined is my party. <laughs> she looks so weird, she's got to be dangerous. We're the ones who should be calling the police. Definitely. Well, do it. Do what? Call the police. Uh, you call them. It's your party she's ruining, unless you don't care that all your friends have a terrible time. Monsters, here, have some treats. <laughs> <laughs> Looks like they're not the only monsters in Kittery. We've got a mutant. Oh dear, isn't that Fiona's neighborhood? What's up? Got a bogey and it's not far from you. I'm downloading the coordinates to your GPS now. 
You and Buzz check it out. I'll notify the others. Trick or trouble, Fio. That mutant's right next door. We've got to neutralize it before it finds Mrs. Krell. Listen, Buzz and I have to go next door and check something out. Dino trouble? Just behave yourself. And don't let anyone leave the backyard. It's just some trick-or-treaters, but now that that spider's mutated, they're going to be treated to a real trick. Mrs. Krell? You into that lady's first stuff? No, I'm into that Spinosaurus's first stuff. you to stay at the party. I'm sorry, I had to come tell you. I... I called the cops. What? When? After Mrs. Krell ruined my party, I wanted to ruin her night too. Terry, that's an awful thing to do. But she's always glaring at me out her window. She looks so weird and weird people are dangerous. I'm weird to some people, but I'm not dangerous. <laughs> It's in that house. That six kids have gone in and no one's come out. Maybe the mutant spider got them. This is Raptor 9. We may have a situation here. You better alert Dr. Velocity. There's something big at the end of the hall. <laughs> you look like an orange snow cone. Ew! Who slimed my dew? And what's making my scanner read off the chart? I think that guy's guilty on both counts. Caruso, look out! Chill it, Caruso! another dino signature on my scanner. That second one isn't a mutant. Judging by the readout, it could be a Spinosaurus. We've got to get into that house. Mrs. Krell ruined our party. You should arrest her. She's weird looking. Is that why you called us? Not me. My friend did. Young lady, calling the police is a serious matter. You can't just call because you don't like someone's appearance. We- I'll take over from here, officer. You're Victor Velocity, head of Raptor Dine. What are you doing here? I've brought my team to investigate a possible outbreak in this house. Please, get those people back until we know if it's safe. An outbreak? We're lucky to have your expertise, sir. Thank you. Patrol the property. Make sure no one gets near the house. I'll call you when I'm ready. Okay, everyone keep back. some room, Fiona. We can't get a clear shot. It's not like this dining room was built for a Spinosaurus tea party. Chill and spill! I 
little guy. You're cute now. That you're not all big and mutiny. Come on, Theo, let's get out of here. That spider mutant bit her. Dump the dino disguise and we'll get you back to the lighthouse so Ms. M can check you out. No, Fiona, wait. You're allergic to spiders, aren't you? In dino mode, she's so big, the spider poison is only enough to make her feel ill. But if she reverts back to normal, her relative body mass will be so low, it could cause a severe allergic reaction. But if she stays dino, how do we get her to the lighthouse? We'll have to sneak her through the trees along the creek. Uh, what's plan B? Why? Because plan A comes complete with two cops, a crowd, and a roll of police tape. Costumes! What about costumes? Mrs. Carell said there were two punks in dark costumes in her front yard. Velocity's henchmen! And where there's his men, there's Velocity. Either there's a dinosaur out trick-or-treating tonight, or Velocity's just gone raptor. We'll never get her out of here before Velocity finds us. We can't just let that creep catch her. The only way we're gonna get her out of here is if we can neutralize the spider venom. Maybe Miss Moynihan can synthesize some anti-venom. I'll get a sample of the mutant venom. Take this back to the lighthouse. Airmail! Roger that, Roger. Fiona, can you make it into the kitchen? We'll keep Velocity away from you until Buzz gets back. Block the doors as best you can. I want to stay with you. Go Dino! He's headed this way! Hurry! <laughs> called and filled me in. Let's have that venom sample. It's a mutation of ordinary spider venom. Probably Argiope arantia, a common garden spider. Whipping up some mutant anti-venom shouldn't be too difficult. Where's Terry? Maybe she went back to her sister. If so, Velocity's going to find both of them. Roger and I will hide. You'll be the bait. Isn't that the little guy who wiggles on the hook until the big fanged fish comes along and gobbles him up? We're raptor baiting, not bass fishing. Just do it. Go Dino! <laughs> Let's have some of that breath over here, Caruso. <laughs> What are you going to do to me? 
Save you from that horrible beast? What did you think I was going to do? When I saw that you weren't surprised at seeing a Velociraptor, I thought maybe you were a... I... I don't know. I guess I thought you were kind of weird, like everyone says. Everyone? Including you? I've heard the rumors, and I've seen the way you look at me. But you're the one who's always scowling at me. Because you're just as intolerant as the rest of them. Always jumping to conclusions, assuming you know everything. I don't live alone because I want to. I do it to get away from people like you, who won't let me live in peace. No one's let me live in peace. Not since it happened. Since what happened? <gasps> They're beautiful. Does this have something to do with what happened? I was about your age when I saw it. Just like the one downstairs. When I tried to tell people what I saw, they made fun of me. So I stopped talking about dinosaurs and started painting them instead. I've been painting ever since. I'm sorry. I didn't realize... Baking Secrets of Marie Antoinette. Sounds like velocity. Let's unleash a can of dino on that dude. Go dino! Go dino! 25 million years back, 50 million years back, back 65 million years back. Go dino! Ow! Fossilized beaver out of my nose! Caruso? Where's Velocity? How should I know? I thought you saw him. We thought he had you. What was that? I really hope I'm wrong, but I say that's the sound of too much weight on too little wood. What was that? Sounds like something landed on the roof. Oh. Oh! Thanks, uh, Mrs. Carell. Or, uh, would you believe that that was just a new holographic dino Halloween costume? No. It's cool, Buzz. She's seen a dinosaur before. Awesome. I've got to get this anti-venom to Fiona. I'll go with you. Something's down there. I could smell it. Okay, folks, it's all clear. You can go on back home now. Happy Halloween. Well, this place is starting to look better already. I appreciate your students fixing up my house, Ms. Moynihan. And don't worry, their secret is safe with me. The last thing I need is more ridicule. Thank you, Terry. The flowers look beautiful. You can go home now. You've done the eight hours of work your parents required you to do. If you don't mind, Mrs. Krell, I'd like to keep working. I really do feel bad for being such a lousy neighbor, but I promise I'll never judge a book by its cover again, especially because you turned out to be such a nice book. I mean, lady. That's very kind of you, Terry. Getting to know all of you has helped me realize that staying alone in my house wasn't just keeping people away from me, it was keeping my life away as well. 
Nice try, guys, but no matter how you paint it, it'll always be ugly to me. Hey, Terry, we're going to the mall. Wanna come with? No thanks, Samantha. I'd rather hang out with someone who's really cool. Mrs. Krell. <laughs> <gasps> oh. It's good to have my sweet little sister back. <laughs> <laughs> You don't have to be a Dino Squad hero to help save the Earth. Be cool. Reduce, reuse, recycle. Change my DNA.